Zach Sang and the gang. Zach Sang and the gang hanging out right now in the studio. Derek Thieler. Hello, 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 sir. Hello. How are you? Hello. I'm doing great. How are you? Dude, you might be the best looking human being to ever come into the <laughs> studio. That, oh, man. That oh. is probably accurate. And the <laughs> tallest. <laughs> yeah. Uh, maybe the tallest. I don't know. I'm turning <laughs> red now. All right. <laughs> what is more annoying it. for you when people come up and recognize you from Baby Daddy or people come up to you and ask about your height? Well, I've been dealing with the height thing pretty much, you know, for 10, 12 years now. I feel now, that, so, man. Yeah. Except the opposite yeah, way. Yeah. Look at you in my pocket. How, how short like, are no. you? I, uh, how tall are you? How's the weather up there? Um, well, the baby daddy thing's newer, so I'd probably yeah. go with more annoying, the tall thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> How yeah. tall are you? Uh, well, it depends on who's asking me. My actual <laughs> resume... For for oh. acting gigs and casting directors, That's it funny. says I'm six four, but don't tell anyone. I'm like a legit six six and a half, almost six seven. Wow! Yeah, that's yeah. Like Wait, almost so, a foot taller. Than, that's like a foot and a half taller than me. Why do you <laughs> Why do you say that you're shorter? Is that like a, a casting trick? Why? It, yeah, well, of course. I mean, all yeah. my all my co stars of the the leading men are five foot five. Yeah, they're <laughs> not, you're like towering. They're over not going to give me like a supporting role yeah. when I get beat up by a five foot five dude. You know? <laughs> Herman Munster, though, that one's yours. Yeah, that's all mine. I'm the, I'm the crazy creeps. <laughs> You've had a pretty great career. I've been following you because my sister watches Baby Daddy, and I was okay. just and I, I know uh, is Jean right? That's how you say it because he's from Canada. Yeah, Jean Luc. Jean Luc. Yeah. He's been on the show before. He's a really cool dude, yeah, and you know, been following the show on and off. You've had a really awesome career because of it. Weren't you just shooting a movie? I was. Yeah. Mm. I oh man, I had the time of my life. I was in uh, South Africa. That's so shooting cool. uh, an action movie about Ooh. sharks. See, oh yeah. I feel like that's like that that's like where your future is heading. That's what I thought nah. too. The last thing I thought I'd be doing is, you know, working on a family TV <laughs> show, sitcom, you know, walking around telling jokes all day with babies. That's, and four seasons I thought I'd be later. beating people up, you know. But the success of your show has been really crazy. Yeah. I mean, we yeah. were talking four seasons, you don't know if you're gonna get picked up for five. I'm sure you will. I mean, you've had some serious success, more than a lot of ABC family shows have had. Yeah. Yeah, we we're very thankful. And uh, you know, I, I think the main reason that that we have had that, that this amount of success is because of uh, our cast and our crew. We're just such a tight knit group. We love going to work. It's yeah. yeah, it's all jokes all the time. Everyone's in you know in high spirits and ready to have fun together. That's rare to find. Yeah, yeah. it it really is, and um, it's it's what we have. It's it's like lightning in a bottle, you know. And we've we've only been doing it for a couple of years now. And we're all best buds. Only that's a couple awesome. of years, but in television, that's like that's that's yeah, a lifetime. I, I, that's I know, an but, but but it's it's our fourth season, and we've really only been together for two and a half years. Yeah, so you were shooting two seasons a year. Close to that, yeah. Wow. I mean, it's just, our, wow. our seasons have been kind of crazy, but our first season was only like ten episodes, okay. and then we got picked up right after that and shot our next season like very awesome. soon after. Oh, that's so, cool. yeah. And um, uh, Chelsea's in the show, right? Yeah, she is. Yeah. Mm. Oh my God, she came on the show years ago. She's so cool too. Yeah, she's cool. She's you have a really cool cast. Yeah. Taj is a Disney Channel royalty. I know. I'm, yeah. the, I'm the new guy to like <laughs> yeah. to like the, the kid actor thing. That's awesome. I, uh, I didn't. I didn't grow up doing Disney Channel and, and ABC yeah. Family stuff. Right. Yeah, you never where, know where you can end up. Yeah, right. Where do you see your career going, though? More action movies? I want to be a superhero. Really? Yeah. I, see, I feel yeah. like that's perfect. That'd That's be cool. exactly what I'm here. Well, you for. have a billion yeah. Marvel movies to pick from, I so know, I know. the next I, four the, years of uh, time. Yeah. I, uh, I'm really hoping to get a good opportunity in something like that. That's yeah, exactly, Captain Marvel, maybe. That's you know, <laughs> that's that's why I moved to Los Angeles because I wanted to be a superhero. Very really? Cool. Very yeah. cool. Was that that was really it? I mean, that was the reason I came. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> now, yeah. when you have that idea, who do you go to to pitch that to? Who do I go to? Yeah, like because you want to be a superhero, right? Well, like if I want to be a superhero, I'm going to my manager, I'm going to my agent, I'm saying, hey, dudes. Oh, trust me, and they're yeah. aware. They, they're, <laughs> they know. You put it out there. You, I mean, I, I'm working out right now for the, the next Wolverine role in like four or five years after Hugh Jackman's given it up. So you good. know, like I'm, I'm getting yeah, in shape for yeah. it now. I feel like that's only a, mo uh, like a matter of time. Is uh, that is that who your ideal superhero is to play Wolverine? I would love. You're going for an X Men. Cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, mean, I, I can dig it. Th there's there's a lot that I would be absolutely happy with, but that's that's one of that's them. The, mm, I like it. I that, like it. That, that's on like the top of the the dream dream. That's your dream chart, superhero, you know, nice. like or whatever. That's right. cool. The cool. dream mural. Yeah. Yeah. See, like if I was to go to my manager, or my agent, and say I really want to play a superhero, they'd go, Zach, look in the mirror, <laughs> and you go, and the, yes, yes, <laughs> that's perfect for you. Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> Done. Uh, there's ten contracts already coming in. <laughs> It's already I, perfect. I wish it was that easy. Yeah, right. <laughs> right? Yeah. That's how it works. Yeah. Uh, wh like, where are you originally from? Uh, I was born in Alaska, but uh, mm -hmm. from Colorado. I, I spent okay. most of my life growing up in, uh, in Colorado Springs on an Air Force base. My folks, uh, you know, 
that's where they're from. Went to school in Fort Collins. I uh, got my degree at Colorado State University. Wow. I got my degree in pre-medicine, actually. Really? That's yeah. Awesome. Yeah. And so, uh, and then as soon as I got that degree, I'm like, nope. I'm going to LA. <laughs> I'm going to go be an action yeah. hero. <laughs> okay, bye. Yeah, yeah. Who told you that you, you should move to LA? Or was that something that you just realized on your own? I was on spring break my junior year of college, and I came to LA just for fun. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I loved movies growing up. I'd never really been in a theater class or mm-hmm. a play my whole life. I'd always been an athlete. Yeah. And uh, I just kind of landed in L.A. and said, wow, I, I kind of dig this. Cool. And then uh, met a couple of actors and learned yeah. a little bit about what it's like to be in the industry and uh, talked to maybe some acting coaches and some agents and got some good, you know, good responses. Yeah. And so then yeah. I was like, I okay, I'll, 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 I'll sign up for my elective acting class in college now when I'm trying to get my, my pre-med degree. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> and next thing you know, like a year and a half later, I saved up enough money to move out all by myself Very and cool. hit the ground running. You know? Very cool. Was that a scary decision for you to make moving to L.A.? Absolutely, yeah, because um, no one in my family and none of my friends had ever done anything like it before. Yeah. I, I was surrounded by, you know, Midwest uh, right. modest people, you know. And, um, yeah, it was kind of a, a decision that I made on my own and just went for it. And I'm, I'm really happy. I'm here now. First role Woo! you've ever gotten. The first role? Yeah. Oh, man. I, what I worked, was it? I worked as a background actor <laughs> several times. In, in some cool movies. Which I feel like that's really a challenge for you because I feel like the attention might go directly <laughs> yeah. to you. The problem is I, I'm a foot taller than everybody. Right, right, right. <laughs> and like, I mean, I'm the size of a door. Yeah, so. you eclipse everything. <laughs> yeah, right. So it's, I don't know. It was, I don't even know what my first gig was. I did some commercials. Okay. Like that, that's actually, I was very lucky. I made some money doing commercials mm-hmm. right when I got off it's the a good plane. Way to do yeah. It. yeah. 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 I mean, it's, it's great money. One, one day's work can pay your bills for a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Yeah. And um, I did. Things like like Arby's and Coke Zero and nice. Kayak.com. Like those are some of the commercials. Like yeah. a State Farm commercial. That, That's pretty cool. good. Yeah, yeah. So that was that was um kind of my first couple of gigs for sure. Yeah. yeah. Well, when did you, when you found out you got Baby Daddy? Dude, mm-hmm. that's exciting. Was that is it, was that your first major? It was a big series? deal. It was my first lead role yeah. at, in anything, and um, I was in the the drive through at KFC. Because <laughs> I was you know I was I was a broke actor. Pretty Only much. someone right. who's originally from you know Alaska and then Colorado yeah. would go to LA and actually still utilize the KFC right, drive through. Right. Yeah, hey, no, that was me. Yeah, K- KFC drive through, you know, and um, I got the call in the drive through. <laughs> You know, I, I was like, I, I'm out of here. So I, you know, <laughs> speeding out of the drive through without paying for anything or actually without even getting my food. And I got all my boys and took them to the Sizzler. Oh, yeah, <laughs> moving on, on up, moving it's, it's on like, up. Yeah, moving on up. <laughs> so there's like seven of my boys and we're all like high-fiving. Getting, and getting buffet. Going, having a drink before walking into the Sizzler. Oh, that's so the good. Best, that's the best I could treat him to. Living it up, man. <laughs> so funny. You guys, I'm the lead on a new TV guys, show. I got Sizzler. A show. That's we're like, going to get steak. <laughs> nice. Sizzler. We're going to get steak at Sizzler. We're not going to Morton. Is that even real steak? Not even uh, sure. Probably but not. Probably not even It's the cow. thought that counts, guys. <laughs> it's chicken. It's just really brown. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Really brown and pink in the middle. Ew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's pretty crazy. You've had, I mean, how long have you been in LA in total? Um, Not long. A little over four years. Yeah. Wow. Some people go there. I mean, you oh, walk around God. the town and it's like every every waitress who's like over yeah. twenty yeah, I, has been and, there. And for and four you know, years. I, I understand that, and yeah. I, I feel very appreciative. I I'm very happy, and you know what? I I think a lot of it is too is just like the attitude, and I'm very I'm very driven, and I I'm, like yeah. I said, I got my degree. It's like. I know exactly what I'm doing here. I know what to, exactly. I, I know to make the right choices mm-hmm. to to not stay out late partying and yeah. make the wrong kind of friends. And it's all about yeah. you know getting to the hard next de- goal. Hard decisions to 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 make though. I mean, especially like choosing the right people to hang out with. True. And yeah. Not yeah, yeah, party. yeah. Um, but it is easier if I, I was a little bit older. Like I said, I was yeah. a little bit yeah. older when I got to that town. Helps. <laughs> and you know, I was in my early 20s and I got to town and I knew exactly what I needed to do and. And I knew some of the steps to take it, you know, yeah. take acting classes, yeah. take it seriously, you know, make, find an agent. And um, I was just very fortunate to fall into the place that I'm in now. But I got a long way to go. Yeah, yeah. sure. Isn't that is kind of fun, right? Because yeah. You've accomplished, it's you know, it's your It's exciting. Own yeah. TV it, show it's, and it's, there's so much more. And I feel like um, opportunities are coming and I just got to take advantage of them. And if, yeah. I do, if I make the right choices, man, I am going to be in that Marvel movie woo, woo, in two woo, summers. Woo, woo. You know? I want to see you in yeah. the Marvel movie. Yeah. 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 But it's scary. The pressure of making those right decisions sometimes. Mm-hmm. I mean, literally, I just came out of a meeting that was all about negotiations. Right. And it's it's very scary to make those right decisions because mm-hmm. it's a 50-50 chance 
at the end of the day. Right. Mm-hmm. Now, Everything. It, 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 I understand that too. It's uh, you got to say no to some things yes. in yeah. order to uh, in order to get to the long term goal. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So uh, yeah, it's it, there's a lot of pressure, but yeah. it's exciting. Yeah, it's good stuff. Wow, and you 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 live with your co-star? I live with Jean Luc. Yeah, he uh, he's my roommate and my TV brother. Annoying sometimes. Yeah, I can't get away from him sometimes. You guys, but we, we live in a you know we live in a, yeah. a decent sized house where we rent out with some That's of other cool. f- our friends and um, it's cool. We we get along fine. How many he's people cool do you dude. live with? I live with four of us all together. Three other dudes. Oh my god! Wow, yeah, they're, they're my like boys. Like it's I, I'm sure the house is huge. <laughs> it's not. I mean, it's not. I mean, huge, but, it's, but yeah. it's big enough it's like, for us to get away to, from each other. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Well, I have friends that do that. Like I feel like that a lot of people do that in LA. Uh-huh. Yeah. And I'm you know looking for places, and it's just like. I don't want to be next to anybody. Mm-hmm. I want to just be myself. Right. Get away from me. Well, yeah. How yeah. do you do it? Is it annoying? Um, it's not annoying. It's it's not that bad. We we're friends. You know, it's not like we hate <laughs> each other. It's yeah, crazy. we get along fine. But we have our own lives too yeah, yeah. outside of work. Unless it's after the show night, you know, on our yeah. show night we all go out and have sure, a drink together. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we do. Well, you enjoy we, each other. We it's celebrate not like, yeah. a good show. That's good. So, yeah, it's it's fun. Good and vibes. It's all good vibes. That's it's all not positivity. bad. Oh, hey, baby daddy, mm-hmm. December. You have a Christmas episode. Christmas Aww. episode, December tenth. I've been getting it wrong all day. Um, <laughs> December tenth, uh, baby daddy, Christmas episode. It's. Um, it's kind of a hypothetical situation if mm-hmm. Christmas didn't exist, Ooh. which means That's scary. if Emma didn't exist Aww. because our baby mama met our baby daddy, Ben, at a Christmas party. Ooh. So uh, I love that stuff. So uh, we, we go like, you know, fast forward, or I guess it's not even fast forward. It's into a different dimension Ooh. as in the current time if Emma and Christmas never existed and see, you know, our, our lives are considerably worse. Ooh. Yeah, it's, it's Christmas shenanigans. Christmas is what shenanigans, it is. And, and it's funny. Nobody besides Ben knows about Christmas. We've never heard of it before, and he's running around uh. telling everyone, "What's happened to Christmas? Where's Emma?" And you know, <laughs> all of us had to act like we have no idea what's happening, <laughs> which is fun. That's it. That is. Fun. Yeah, and then, um, and then by the end of the show, um, there is a, a musical number <gasps> that, that the uh, the Wheeler family band is back together. Oh uh, yeah. Dance? I, I try to. You do. <laughs> you do. I feel like I, watching you dance might be like a little. It's uh, it's a comical sight. for sure. Yeah, it's, <laughs> oh my it's, God. it's humorous. Um, no, I I have to actually play the bass guitar. Never done that before. Hey. <laughs> and sing. Never done that before. <laughs> so I we actually went into a uh, recording studio and I had to lay down the track uh, for ooh. my for my background look, vocal. Nice. Look at those terms you're using. You're a professional. Those music terms. Yeah. Uh, I didn't even know if that was right. <laughs> <laughs> so, I believed it. So I, I, I sing the. The whole song through, and the whole like my uh, the producers and my cast all had to sit there and listen to me try to sing the best that I can. Aww. It was awful, and I'm sure they're <laughs> gonna turn my track way down. <laughs> they're gonna turn up. Isn't that one of the coolest things about TV is that you get to do some of the craziest stuff? Yeah, it's, it's amazing because that you never know every week. What they're going to throw yeah. at you. Especially on our show, man. It's like I'm wearing a different costume yeah. every other episode. I'm, I'm wearing something crazy. That's awesome. It, and I love it. I love the costume thing. I'm like a superhero or I'm, I'm a half horse, half man centaur. It's, <laughs> it's You never know. So it's, it's, it's always a good time. Real Very question. Cool. Real question. Is it hard to be as good looking as you? I hate. Is that a real question? And- no, real question. <laughs> Um, I don't know. I don't. I don't really I see feel it that like way. I think that's subjective. Anything it has ups and downs, mm-hmm. right? I, I don't. I don't know how to answer Listen, that. Listen, take I, it from me. It is hard to be yeah, yeah. this yeah, good okay. looking. You can it's like that one. it's like it's. I mean, I, I figure I'll answer it for you. Thank it's you. like Thank people you. are always like, "God, you're so beautiful. God, you're so pretty," and I'm like, "Ugh, stop!" It's like get it. something else to I say. Know. Like, yeah. I mean, I also have uh, a mind, right? Yeah, like, yeah. let's talk about how beautiful my mind is. So I'm assuming you can empathize with all the things. Same page as Sasha. Same yeah. page. Same page, Z's. I, I get the Except tall. The the taller I get the version, tall thing yeah, yeah, all the time. Yeah. Taller version. So I, I guess that's that, that's what most people come up to me and tell me. Yeah. It's like, wow, you're the tallest man I've ever seen. I'm like, I doubt that. I've seen which, taller than yeah, you. Yeah, like, which is definitely which is definitely false. Yeah, yeah. Hollywood. There's a thousand different people, <laughs> a thousand different sizes. Exactly. Yeah. That's the craziest thing, and I, that's why the town is so great. Is that like I've walked on sets and they're doing casting calls, 
and like the most you know direct thing that you need whatever you mm-hmm. need whether it's you know a little person who knows how to surf perfectly mm-hmm. you send in a casting call within an hour you have a you dozen have, yeah. you, little people who can surf perfectly you have no idea when i used to do uh, like the commercials i like yeah. go into castings yeah, yeah, yeah. and stuff like that and I would walk into a room and see six guys that look just like it's me. Crazy. Yeah. One of them's got more tattoos. Yeah. One of them's hair is a little blonder. It's bizarre. One of them's got a goatee. But they're all like exact. I'm, <laughs> I'm, the, tall, I'm the tall yeah. one of the bunch. You right, know? Like, right, right, right. I'm the tall lookalike of me. Right. So everyone knows me too. So yeah. it's like, oh, hey, what's up, man? It's uh, We're all like, you know, <laughs> it's in crazy. the same, tall, the same guy. litter. Yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> it's weird. That's awesome. The same litter. Dude, you're going to have a crazy career, man. Congratulations on everything. Best of luck with everything, and you know, Baby Daddy on ABC Family, yeah. and hopefully you get another season. But I, I'm hoping to see you in a Marvel movie real soon. Oh yeah! Thank you so much. I had a great time, guys. Dude, and when you land it, you can come back and promote it here. I will come back oh, and promote yeah. it. I uh, yeah, looking forward to it. Thank you, brother. Thank you.